So this kind of thing that you're doing is really um, very realistic in that you probably won't ever get a lot of all the skills, but you'll get hold of some, and it's really important that I think you get hold of the idea that you learn to have an effect. It's really good that you learn that it happens in a team. Because there's a lot of egos in there, there's a lot of temperaments, and a lot of very strong ideas about how things should go. But if you're not a leader and you're creative, you've got to be strong enough to stand up and put your point forward. Because if that's how you are, and you want to be creative, and you want to work in a creative field, and you're not naturally one of those people that stands to the fore, you're going to have to learn how to push your point. Because if you don't, it'll sink. Graphic designer is always considered ourselves as a visual communicator. So for our job, it's not just simply put a piece of graphic or put a piece of artwork onto somewhere and show you, nah, this is our work. Whatever we put up there, or whatever we show it to you, have to communicate a piece of message. And you want to communicate a message, you need to find the right audience. So now you need to think about, okay, now I'm going to do a visual culture. Who is my audience? Who is going to read my magazines? Who is going to see my website? And what's the best way to deliver this message?